Oh, hi. I didn't see you there. It's uh, Saturday morning. It is 6.30 a.m. And guess who's excited today? I am. Guess where we're going? Performance driving school with Porsche. So um, this is where I learned how to drive a Porsche like a regular human. It's a safety course. It's all safety training where you put yourself in situations where the vehicle loses control and then you learn how to regain control. Um, and that's something I've toyed around with my entire life. So I'm really excited to do it with people who know what they're doing and can actually teach me a lot. In fact, I've already learned that there was some pre-class study stuff and I've already learned a lot. So really excited for today and uh, hope that I get some videos of uh, me and some cars uh, doing some fun stuff. So uh, it's uh, I got an hour to drive to get down there and then we can get started. Out of the track, well, not really a track, more a huge parking lot out of the AHOS. We are in uh, three groups. Starting off this morning with skid pad. The sun's in my eyes. I don't know if you can tell all the Porsches over there, but there's uh, more than a few. I think we got uh, 41 drivers supposed to be out here today, and then lots of other volunteers helping out and uh, some watchers as well too. Just about ready to get started. Alright, here we go. Headed out to the skid pad. Kind of fun. We are Team Yellow. We gotta go find the yellow guys. Alright, this is my all my friends in the yellow group today. Getting ready for the slick track. There's one of my favorites right there. So she holds up okay throughout the day. There's a spider, love the spider. Classic red one there. Just about ready to head on out. The instructor's going out to show us what we'll be doing. So he's actually changing the diameter of the radius by giving it more and less gas. It looks kind of boring, but you're actually uh, going closer and farther from the cones depending on the amount of throttle while you hold your steering wheel in exactly one position the entire time. Oops. It's actually pretty cool. So we just did the wet track with AB and uh, it's a lot of water out there get you dirty and they warned me they said hey you may want to put your top up it's going to get dirty inside and i was like uh it's just so much fun with the top down and they said yeah it definitely is so uh the inside doesn't look too bad right yet but uh, outside definitely got a little dirty had a lot of fun amazing that you can actually steer your car with just the throttle by holding the steering wheel uh, in the same spot so that was an amazing experience and uh ab did a great job of teaching me how to do that That back wheel's coming up off the ground. Yeah, the rear wheel's almost all the way off the ground. That's cool. Once, once we've done that a couple times, I'll say, please take the wheel. Mm -hmm. Then you can unfold your arms, take the wheel. I'll let go. Okay. Um, and then at that point, we'll start pushing harder and try and get the car to spin. Okay. Uh, uh, that guy's still on course. Should I race him? <laughs> okay. So, we'll start circling on the inside. Okay. I'm going to reach over and take the wheel. Okay. Got it. Okay. Okay. Now I want you to start adding throttle. Okay. Gently. Uh -huh. Feel the car push out. Yeah. Now lift off gently. And now add throttle. And take it away. Let the car come all the way in. Okay. Gently, gently. And now out. Out, out, out. And in. Lift and let it come in. All right, gas. And lift. Very nice. I, I'd like you to go. take the wheel back now. Got it. Okay. 
now we'll do that again. We'll, we'll push it to the outside. Okay. Gently, gently, gently. Uh -huh. Push, 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 push. Okay. Keep pushing, keep pushing. And lift. Good. There we go. Yep. All right, now let's do that again. Okay. Push. 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 And lift. There we go. Nice. <laughs> Good catch. Thank you. All right. And again. Okay. Push, 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 push. Feel the front scrub. Now lift. I didn't lift enough. Yeah, that, you got to be pretty snappy with the lift. Yeah. And this time when you lift, I want you to get back into the gas immediately afterward. Lift. Gas. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty cool. <laughs> and that is how we drift. <laughs> oh, I love it. All right, now push. Push, 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 lift, and gas. And a little too much gas, and you do a 180. <laughs> Let's start it back up again. There we go. Good times. <laughs> yeah, that was good. All right, now we've got the red, red flag, flag, so we'll exit right over there. Awesome. That was so cool. <laughs> yeah, that's always fun. <laughs> Thank you. Two sessions getting a little dirtier. Inside still looks clean, but it's been a lot of fun. There we go. Now we're doing the slalom where we're going in and out of uh, cones. So we'll have an instructor join us in a second. We're about four cars back. Probably not gonna be as exciting as the slick skid track, but uh, should be fun. How's it going, Herb? Oh, afternoon, sir. <laughs> All right, you ready to show me how to drive? I will coach you as well as I can. <laughs> so I've got a 99 Boxster, so. Do you? I yep. do too. This is a 2000 S, but I, okay. my first one was I got for 2200 bucks. Really? Yeah, so that's what got me into this. Good. Okay. And then I was like, oh, I just need a little bit more speed. And yours is doing the same thing mine did, those little Both chunks. Mine. Yeah, the little chunks of felt coming out felt, of the AC unit. Yeah, the, the foam that yeah. I think lines the air. Okay, ready? Yep. Nope. Just keep it in first all time? Yeah, for now. It looks like everyone's kind of doing a parade lap. So yeah. if you go a little bit faster, you kind of will begin to feel, you know, a car is just a set of you know, springs and rubber. So it's very much like a, uh, you gotta go, oh, It's a set of springs and rubber. It's basically like a pendulum, and it has a natural, uh, a natural frequency it wants to oscillate at, just okay. like a pendulum does. Yeah. You know, and and the one of the secrets to going through a slalom well is finding out what that rhythm is, and and as the car compresses itself on its springs and then bounces back up and comes back, back, and you're simultaneously uh, manipulating the wheel to uh -huh. get it. So you got to you know, once you find out, after having practiced, obviously, on a track, where where the car wants to go through smoothly, yeah. as it's helping you. Because if you if you fight against those things, it upsets the car, and next thing you know, you're not going to be very smooth or very fast. Okay. And then one of the other things I, I'd like for you to start concentrating on, and it's something that you can learn more as you drive on the street, is I saw you putting your hand on the inside of the wheel yes. to, to go back and forth. And that's uh -huh. something, you know, working the outside of the wheel because if say you hit a hit a hit an obstacle or something like that and the wheel kicks back, it's gonna hit you in the wrist. Okay. You know? So 
we always want to try and keep our hands on the outside of the wheel or you know if you've got power steering you palm the wheel okay that's fine but uh, I try and avoid doing that okay. just because it's it's one of those that's things good. that needs to be uh, that can catch you up if you're not careful with it. yeah thank you sure absolutely I guess I gotta jump into the next car all right all right it. thanks good luck all right Nine and three. Nine and three. Oh, got out of the rhythm. I I look, 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 look at where you're going. Uh, yep. Okay, slow down, slow down, cut all the way across. Cut, okay. cut all the way across. Felt like my rhythm was a little bit off there with the letting off the gas. Okay. And the turning. So uh, let's use this exercise to work on steering. Uh -huh. Nine and three, right? Okay. No crossing over. Yeah. Ro keep rolling. Keep uh -huh. rolling. Keep rolling uh -huh. up. Okay. Nine and three. Yep. You should be able to do this exercise by doing this. Okay. And not crossing over. Got if, it. If, you, if on the U-turn, because it's a sharper turn, mm -hmm. you can shuffle steer. You okay. Familiar with shuffle uh -huh. steering? Okay, shuffle steer, but don't get, get it. Get Got out it. of the hab out of the habit of crossing over. Got it. We'll do. Apparently, I need to get my hands on the wheel. Versus what? I oh dancing yeah. Around. So hopefully, it's only being able to. You only need to turn it at about this much. Yeah. Got some old bad habits. Oh yeah, we all did. Ready? Yep. yep. So we come around. Lift, turn. Yes. Okay, lift, turn. Okay, I gotta get the monitor down. Gas, turn, lift. No, gas, lift, turn. Gas, lift, turn. It's like gas, lift, turn. Gas, lift, turn. It's yeah, amazing. It happens quick. Yeah. Okay. Gas, lift, turn. Gas, lift, turn. Gas, lift, turn. Gas, lift, turn. Gas. Lift turn. Uh, yeah. I'm totally out of it. Uh, that, that was, we were, we were getting okay. in rhythm. But uh, yeah, it's that quick on this. Yeah. Because they're so close together. It's like, yeah, gas. Okay, we're going up. And then it's lift to get the front end of bite. Turn and then gas. So yeah. it's really quick. You got to be quicker. Than yeah. That. So it's, and so it's uh, not, and, and we don't have to jump on and off the gas that much. But, okay. A but little gentler? But yeah, a little gentler, but okay. man, yeah, it's gotta be quick on this. Alright. Yeah. Sounds great, thanks. We'll see. Yeah. I'll see you come with you again. <laughs> gas. Gas. Lift turn. Lift turn. Gas. Gas. Lift turn. Gas. Lift turn. Gas. Lift turn. Gas. Lift yeah, turn. Good one gas. there. That one. That's a good one. That's a good one. Right there. Oops. Right there. <laughs> My bad. No, you're good. It wasn't you. Now wait about four cones for this guy. Okay. Okay. Gas. Gas. Lift, lift turn. turn. Gas. Lift turn. Gas. Lift turn. Very good. Gas. Lift turn. Gas. Lift turn. Very good. All right. Thank what you. I want you to what I want you to practice on next time you're uh -huh. through. Yeah is keeping your gas a little steady or not as not as dramatic not as much dr dramatic shift other than that then you'll pick that up as yep. you're going through so okay? don't be lift all the way off just lift a little yeah, bit yeah just a lift a little bit you okay know, just enough yeah just enough because the whole idea at least when i've done slalom is to keep uh -huh. almost the same gas and just choo -choo 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 -choo. okay Obviously, so it comes just, with some time, okay? <laughs> but just a but little bit of lift, just to give you a little enough, bit more. Just enough to... Got it, got know. it. That'll help. All right. It's very helpful. Thank you. Yeah. Hello. How's it going? Good. How are you? Good. Having fun? I'm loving this. So I'm telling people, if you're doing this right, uh -huh. it should your engine should sound like you should be in the second gear, and it should sound like wing, 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 because you should be using a combination of the throttle and steering. Uh -huh. So you're adding like a little extra with like a little punch of the throttle uh -huh. to help you because like if you just drive slowly through you're like this right. but if you're using a combination you're like this so it, it lets your steering be less extreme okay if you use your foot as my throttle has been too extreme so I need to not be as as far it's been up too and extreme? down okay well so much. that's then you need to lift 
Yeah. Like if you're someone who likes a lot of throttle, then instead you're using lifts instead of, um, uh, yeah. You, you know what I'm trying to say, right? Yep. I do too much gas and too much lift. I need to just balance it out a little bit more, I think. That's what they tell me. <laughs> so gas, lift turn. Lift. Gas. Okay. So like punch it more. Yeah. Yeah. If I had my driving shoes on, I would say let me do um, <laughs> one round. Yeah. And maybe I'll go put them on. So they're yeah. in my car. They're in my car. a couple times since I last sat yeah. in here with you um, what are you seeing so far oh uh, gosh I'm trying to get the rhythm of the uh, gas lift turn yeah I'm trying to keep my hands on the wheel in front of me and not crossing right. um, and there's a lot going to, on yeah and try not to give it too much or too little throttle like too much variance trying to right. get a little steadier and yeah, I'm trying to avoid those stupid cones too so much to do <laughs> driving this time. Hi. She's going to show me how it's done. I'm going to show everyone how it's done. <laughs> Turn off the radio. What? Oh, it, so it goes faster when the... You need to hear the motor sound. Oh, okay. that's, what's the, that's the important part. Is that part. the trick? Okay. Yeah. So you can also hear the brake sound of that, yeah. that BMW. And I'm not doing this because, like, oh, he's really doing bad. I have to get in no, his car. Say, no, tell him. I'm not really... doing it because, I'm not driving this car because you're doing so poorly that I have to show you the right way. No, I'm doing this great. because I've been driving Boxsters for 20 years and I know exactly how to drive this car. Awesome. So. This is going to be great. I'm trying to show them how it's a combination of a little steering with a little throttle. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so. And that's what we talked about. Because that's end. what I'm not seeing yet. Yep. Mm -hmm. yeah. Some of them are getting it. Some yeah. of them are definitely getting it. It's coming. Okay, driver ready? Yep. There we go. So did you hear that squealing? I did. Uh, Yeah, I so can't do it, but that was awesome. Yeah, you can do it. You certainly can do it. <laughs> that was great. So that's what I want to see. I want to hear. I want to hear the end. You see what I mean by that uh -huh. now? Yep. Okay. Now you do. Uh, now I'm going to try to imitate the master. Yeah. See how it goes. There we go. Hear that engine sound? Mm -hmm. That's doing it the right way. That's what I want to hear. Wing, okay. wing, 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 wing. Without like driving a little in there, rhythmic but... dance. Mm -hmm. Wing, 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 wing. Yep. There you go. Good. Okay, so I think we nailed a couple cones. Yep. <laughs> so. All right. Thank you. Yeah, so that's very helpful. Perfect. Yes, so. appreciate it. You bet. Thanks. 
Hey, thank you! Most cones knocked over in one run. That's, uh, there you go. <laughs> I won. All right, how's it going? It's going good. Uh, Anastasia drove my car, then had me do it. I'm getting a little bit better. Okay. You know? Any I questions? Over, I knocked over five cones last time. Well, I won. Well, I won. you know what? Then you killed five kittens because there's a kitten <laughs> underneath each one of those cones. Uh, that's okay. As long as it's not a puppy. No, they're kittens. Who cares? Yeah. Um, that's why you put them there. Yeah, exactly. Uh, rhythm. Rhythm, rhythm. Uh -huh. We want to have that flow. I want to... You make me seasick. All right. By that steady rhythm. You can really dig deep on this exercise about where you're turning in. Remember, these are late apexes. Yep. I'm sure you already understand all that. Uh -huh. Some guys may be really critical about, oh, your lefts are better than your rights. Okay. As long as your rhythm is consistent, you can you can fix that. It's if you don't have the rhythm, that's a lot harder to okay. to build up to. So that's always my concern with the swallowing and thing. The rhythm. Of it. I'm a I'm a racer. And slaloms are one of my favorite things to do because it, and I'm a musician, so it requires <laughs> that that flow. And sometimes my line isn't that good, but as long as my rhythm is good, I get through it really quick. Mm -hmm. um, that's all I got. I wish we could okay. do a couple of laps because yeah, it would be nice to be able to do like a a, a post lap uh, debrief and then go. Okay, now this time I want you to do this, so it's yeah. kind of hard. Ready? Yep. Yep. All right, Let's see what you got. Nice, aggressiveness. Oh, yeah, dude. Oh, you clip that little guy, clip that one. All right, yeah, you adjusted your line. Perfect. Nice. Good control, dude. Thank you. Thank really you. good control. You can pick it up on this one, they're further apart. Maintain that control, maintain that rhythm. You clip. Good control, clip. I saw that one coming. <laughs> okay, so you see the challenge now, don't you? You're, yep. add, you're adding speed, and as you do, mm -hmm. You need to adjust. That's the most important part of the lesson is that how quickly can you adjust? Because you only have so many cones to do it in. Yeah. That was really good, dude. Thank you very much. Good. Sorry. You're good. You're Sorry, great. Bro. It's brand new. What are you? Oh, geez. Oh, man. <laughs> Go get another one. I saw your last run. That was good. I mean, you oh. hit a bunch of cones, but you were like right. <laughs> you were. You hit the cones because you were right on them. Oh. Like, that was a good run. Well, thank you. That's must been all the coaching you gave me, so. <laughs> Me and a whole lot of other very talented people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so how long have you been driving, like, performance and racing and all that stuff? Um, 15 years driving, uh, 8 years instructing. Wow, that's cool. I, the, the first three years driving were kind of intermittent. It was when I was in college, so I did uh -huh. a little bit of, of driving, mostly in carts. Um, and I wasn't very good. <laughs> so when I graduated from college, I was like, I'm, I'm going to do whatever I have to do to get good because I'm right oh, now I'm not. That's cool. So yeah, it was, it was pretty good. It, it coincided with me having my first like real like adult job. So I had a little bit of money to spend for <laughs> tires and stuff. But, right. So, so let's, you, let's mirror hey. the, the positioning oh. you had in your last run, just like an inch or two wider to stay off the base of the cows. Okay. There we go. That's great. That's great. Go, 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 and slow down for the U-turn. All right. Get on the back side of the first one. That's awesome, man. Oh, thank that. you. <laughs> I don't even know how many come from that but it seemed like less. I think you hit one, and it was right at the very beginning. Cool. And you could just kind of ran over the base. So, <laughs> how, whatever struggles you may have had with the uh, pitch and catch in the morning, you're you're killing this one. All you're right. doing great. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> yes, I, yes, please. Sure. All right. Don't hit her. Mom, I'm gonna try not to. <laughs> Lift turn, gas. Lift turn, gas. Lift turn. All right. Only hit two. That's okay. Yeah. All right, here we go. Lift turn, gas. 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 Let me get back here. Right here. I get out of right here. This guy. There we go. Awesome. Thank you. Whee! That was good. Here. Yeah? Oh, it's all good. Okay, well, good. Thank you. Yeah. Appreciate it. We got closer because we hit two cones. That's okay. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. What's your name? Mark. I'm Jasmine. Hey, Jasmine. How are you? Mark, Mike's, and David's. 
<laughs> yep. Okay. Yep. yep. That was the best one yet, and we bumped the phone and it went off. But uh, one of the guys was having me throttle it, and he's like, gas, 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 and uh, went through a lot faster and hit a couple of cones, but uh, went through pretty fast. That was my best one, and I, I don't know, not that you could see it anyway, but anyway. <clears throat> okay, so this is accident avoidance. Uh, we're going to be testing out the ABS and doing some avoiding measures and other fun stuff like that. This car is lining up for accident avoidance. cars over there which are kind of hard to see driving the course and then over on the far side we got the slaloms going on a bit hard to see out there. This has been a great day with PCA. Okay. So 65, slam on the brakes at the big cone? It just passed the big cone. I want to make sure you're fully in the wet before you stab on the brakes. So just wait until Colin like maybe passes his door. Okay. Okay, ready to go. Okay, and I'll call the brakes. I screen speed here and right now. And we were, they want us to come all the way. Oh, through. come on. That, that's yeah. okay. So anyway, um, two things. You just experienced ABS. Uh -huh. You feel the little, the brakes clicking? Yeah, I, it's funny. I felt ABS in my older cars and uh -huh. it's much more exaggerated. Yeah, it was well, much... they've smoothed it out a little bit. Yeah. But so that's um, kind of a sensation or an indicator that you're in the ABS mode. The, um, the second thing is... Um, wanted to show you that the car stability is such that you can hit the brake as hard as you can and up to a point you won't in, uh, reduce the distance to stop but the third thing is uh -huh. it keeps your, your your car going straight yeah i didn't feel any sliding or anything no, it just... didn't didn't pull it just went straight see no brakes no brakes it didn't seem like it was going very fast yeah. so okay so okay. 40 miles an hour uh-huh Watch the lights for the left or the right signal. Okay. And resist any temptation to brake. Okay. And make sure you do abrupt steering inputs. Okay. And if you get loose, be ready with the gas pedal. Okay. Okay. Ready. Got go. it. All right. All brakes. There we go. <laughs> nice. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Yeah, I know. Really handled handled well. that, yeah. yeah, like nothing. It liked it. <laughs>
guys can hop in your cars. You guys are going to be up in a minute. Okay, last run here. Yeah. Ready, go. Let me help this guy. Yeah. Um, that was the last one, and that was a great way to, to end it. There we go. There go. <laughs> I'm going to help this guy. With the cones? Yeah. I lost my hat. Where is it? <laughs> it's right here. I found okay. it. Okay. I'll catch you up on All right. Thank you. Let me try to get out of here without hurting anybody. <laughs> oh, man. Oops. Dragging a cone. Oh, do you? <laughs> I can grab it out of there. Thank you. I still got still got one more cone under my car. Thank you. Sorry about that, man. <laughs> so that last one was good. We uh, were trying to break it loose. We did broke it loose. I did not recover. I couldn't keep it back in control. And uh, you know, we spun out, and had fun. But uh, anyway, it was a good experience. I've got now some experience with. Um, how my car handles under extreme situations. So uh, it was fine and it was safe and I didn't hurt myself or anybody else or the vehicle. The, the cone, maybe a little little damage to the cone. Uh, I was spun out out of control. That was okay. the end of the track, yeah. Okay, cool. so you got the- I got it to break loose mm -hmm. and then I just, I just didn't respond at all and just let it spin. Okay, so that happens. So. I've done three turns. Really? Well, see, cause the second <laughs> time I, I went to this exercise, I was, uh, I'd been autocross chair for a year. I've been autocrossing for like three years. Yeah. So I wasn't like, you know how he's like cruised down at 40. I was like, fuck no, I want to see if I can get through <laughs> here at 70, you know? Yeah. I was putting on a good show. <laughs> and I mean like chunks of rubber and asphalt are like oh flying through gosh. the car. Like, pat, pat, pat. I was spitting out gravel afterwards. Whoa. It was a Qualcomm. So, you know, the asphalt's not as good. Yeah. Shape, wow. Well, mine was a good as that. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, I think I did like a 180 slash 270. Nice, it finally came to a stop. But mm -hmm. all right, so what you did is great driving. If it was a rainy day and something happened, that's what that's, that's what I want. Yeah. But out here, I'm trying to break it loose, right? Right, yeah. so I want to see like what happens if it's a, a crummy rider. bad day mm -hmm. and that thing's closer, you know? Yeah, uh, did I tell you about the I had a car fall off an overpass once. No. I was on a bike and I'm riding along and my headlight spot, you know, like headlight spot starts getting bright and I go, what the fuck is that? Boom! Volkswagen Golf drops not six feet in front of me. Like, I want you to swerve like that happened. Like, oh shit, you know, you right, know at that right. point the braking isn't doing anything. Yeah. So you got to go for the swerve. Yeah. Okay. Ready, go. Big zigzag, zigzag, gas, 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 brake. Now brake. I forgot to do the gas. You forgot to do the gas, but it's still hooked up. So you got a little lucky. Stop here. Stop and wait, stop and wait. Okay, they're they're still talking. Okay. Wait, wait a minute. No, he's... Just wait for him to launch. Yeah. Okay, let's go. So. You had good reaction. You caught that one with the steering wheel. So if it had been a little wetter, mm -hmm. you might not have caught it. Okay. You know? Yeah. So you, you got it the car unsettled, which is what we're after. Okay. But I want I definitely want to see you rolling onto the gas. Because that's yes. you know, like as the speed picks up, if you're going 70 and trying to do that same maneuver, it's not gonna work. you'll definitely have to be on the gas. You had a good one last time. Oh, thanks. I think so. I think that's I'm remembering that. I right? think it was the one before. Was the one before? Okay. Yeah. But he's doing good. He's doing good. Gas, 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 gas. Right, left, gas, yeah. There okay, now stop, 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 stop. Okay, back to the, uh... all right, good job. Oh, thank you. Okay, let's go. So you see how it popped loose a little bit as you, and you were rolling on the gas and it uh -huh. brought it back in. Yep. Now, if you had 
you could have made that a bit more exaggerated, which would have made the, the sliding around bigger. Uh -huh. But, you know, not necessary. Yeah. No, you're right. Though. I, <laughs> going through my head, I'm like, ah, the first turn, I'm like, ah, I didn't do that enough. You know what I mean? It uh -huh. was too gentle. Yeah, I saw the first one was gentle, and you made up <laughs> yeah, for it on the second one. Yep. I was trying. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> thanks. And again, you know, as we come out of the whatever the second steering input is, as we're straightening, we're rolling onto the gas. Not jamming it, just rolling it. Yeah, just rolling onto it. Mm -hmm. Almost like if the steering wheel's like this, mm -hmm. no gas, and then light gas, and then back to gas. Okay. You know, so like as the steering wheel's straightening, we're rolling on. Okay. Mm -hmm. Whoa, there he goes. That oh. was textbook. <laughs> Did you see that one? I did. He broke it loose and uh -huh. pulled it back in. It was nice. Yeah. Textbook. All right. Let's see if I can do it this time. Well, you did it last time. Oh. I just wanted to be a little bigger now. Okay. <laughs> Ready? Go. All right. Let's go. Show them what's up. It's gas, 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 gas. Now break. Okay. So. The bad news is the cones were in the way. <laughs> but the good news is you stabilized it under, wait, stop, stop okay, here. Okay. You stabilized it under the gas. Thank you. Did you see how that happened? I, it was great, yeah. Yeah, because <laughs> it was coming loose and it would have been a fishtail and a spin if you hadn't been on the gas. Absolutely. All right, let's go. That was cool. Okay. Oh, oh there you go. Oh, looped it good. <laughs> All right, well, it's gonna take a, a little second to clear. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> Last run. Ready? Last run. There you go. Right, gas, perfect. Stop, 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 stop. All right, I think that's Anastasia. She's been racing these apparently for 15 years, boxers. Hey guys, that's it for today. Hey, thanks for uh, watching and uh, feel free to subscribe, ring the bell. So I'd love to see the other videos we have coming up. We've got more uh, Boxster Project videos, repairing and getting that guy up and going. Plus we're gonna have day two of the Performance Driving School. That's gonna come out. Uh, and then some more information. I'm gonna sell the blue one. So I'll have more information about that too. So go ahead and click the bell and uh, check it out. Love to see you again. Thanks.